Hello and welcome back to another RPG Maker Unite tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to reorder your JSONs and I have a free tool to help you do that. So with that said, let's get started. All right, so here we are in the Unite sample project. And basically what goes on is that it's, let's say you have an actor right here and you want to rearrange, let's just say craft, you want to rearrange them into one of these areas. You can't just drag and drop them somewhere. You also can copy them, but you can't paste them in between any of these other actors. You can only paste them when you're highlighted or when your mouse is on this actor part, but it only puts it at the bottom. And so let's just say we wanna keep this nice and clean. How do we do that? Well, you can go into the, the character actor JSON, which is in the project folder, assets, RPG maker, storage, character, JSON folder. And you could go into there and you can find the blocks and you can rearrange them that way, copy paste them and, and put them in order. But I made a tool that makes this so much simpler. So if you go to my itch page, you can scroll down a little bit and you'll find the Unite Character JSON Rearranger. You're gonna go in there, it's just a web tool. You're gonna load your JSON, so that folder that I mentioned, you're just gonna upload that whole folder and it's going to kind of sparse out what it needs. And then you can start to rearrange things. So for instance, in the actors here, I can grab craft, I can drag them uh, between these two individuals and then I can export it. And then I can go to classes, I could do the same thing there. Just make sure any changes that you do, you export before you go on. So it will remember them, but you just want to make sure that you export each one individually kind of a thing. And then we can go to the downloads. I change this actor right here. We go to cut and I paste it into here. And that's really all that it takes. So then you go over here and you will notice though that it doesn't update the list. And it doesn't matter if you try to go to like Unity Editor mode and then back into focus mode. It doesn't work. You have to actually exit out of the project. So make sure you save it. And then you have to re-enter the project. And when we're back, we can go to the actors and we can see that craft is now changed. All of his data is intact and everything like that. So yeah, this tool can really help you out. Just rearrange real quick. In the meantime though, I'm gonna get these uh, quick web tools up and hopefully for all these different types of things like battle skills, states, equipment types, stuff like this. So yeah, if you have any questions, you can comment below, use the Discord or the forums. We'll get you figured out. That said, I'll see you at the next video.